Well, the Drake relays are synonymous with track and field in the state of Iowa. The hallowed blue oval has hosted record breakers, Olympians and champions over the relays 113 year history. The track has transcended gener generations and as Camille Gear shows, shows us, it's now hosting a new generation of runners. April 29th. Steinus with Calibus Wheatland. The day Noelle Steinus cemented her name in the Drake Relays history books. 435 22 for the win. I'm always going to be happy about what happened April 29th. Like, that's going to be a huge day for me. Winning the 1500, the first white flag for the Calamus Wheatland sophomore. No feeling tops that. You know, you lose some, you win some, and those that you win, it makes it even more memorable. I think I was jumping higher and higher <laughs> as she got to the finish like because I knew she was like she was doing it. Like I didn't know how it was gonna end, but she was doing all the right things and I, it was just ecstatic. Like mother, like daughter. There is nothing like the blue oval. Noelle's mom, Jessica, familiar with the Blue Oval herself, winning the 800 in high school and the 1500 in college. I remember my dad, my dad's probably my biggest fan, came down and hugged and <laughs> just, you know, it was just, it's almost like the pinnacle, you know, you, just, you work so hard. But I think I remember like going around the track and I probably even did a full lap. Like you don't do a full lap anymore, but like I did a full lap. A white flag, the coach athlete, mom daughter duo now share. It's cool that we're starting our own like special thing. Everybody has their own special story and this is ours and I love it so much. For the Steinus pair, this win meant more than crossing the finish line. Noelle dislocated her right kneecap this fall one of the lowest points of her young career. She was like, why do things happen? You know, like other people, you know, like why, why does, why do things happen to people? And I think you can see now why. Because mm -hmm. it makes you appreciate, you know, everything that you do. From the lowest of lows to the highest of highs in less than a year. I don't even know if I could tell my August self that, uh, she would flip out. It's awesome that I overcame something like that and came back from it. All worth it to reach the top. But I could confidently say that I'm thankful for my injury happening. Like I think it all happens for a reason and it made me want it more. A white flag in a victory lap. That's now a family affair. Reporting in Calamus, Camille Gear, WQAD, News 8 Sports.